Today we're going to be testing out the cheapest basketball dribbling gadgets versus the most expensive dribbling basketball gadgets, starting with a $5 and one basketball. Now with a $5 basketball, there's really nothing to it. It's a basketball, the person who has to make it work. There's no special thing to go with it, so. For $5, I give this product a thumbs up. It's an indoor, outdoor basketball. It does exactly what you need it to do. If you're trying to start playing basketball, this is a great ball to start with. On to the next gadget. I'm gonna be pretty much using this basketball the entire time for most of these gadgets. Just so we can test out a cheap basketball using these gadgets. We got the dribble goggles. These are priced at around $8 for a three pack on Amazon. So what these do is, keeps you from looking down. I can't even see my own hand right here. I used to wear these all the time when I was younger. They really do work. As you can see, I'm double dribbling. I give this gadget a thumbs up. I really like these goggles. They're not expensive at all. They do help you with your dribbling. If you're advanced and feel like dribbling with your basketball has been great already, get these to really test yourself out. So I'm keeping these goggles on. I have the basketball inside of this slick wrap and we're just gonna keep adding things on to test out my dribbling skills. All right, what this slick wrap is gonna do is gonna make the ball have not too much grip. You can't really grip the ball as much as you would like and normally would. It's gonna test out your hand-eye coordination. Now I can't cheat, keep that in mind. So if I'm losing it, I'm working hard. The slick wrap is $9.99 for one. You could also use a trash bag. Slipped a little bit there. I really like this slick wrap. It makes you really look for the ball with your hands and trust that the ball is going where you place it. Slick wrap, slick wrap, slip wrap. <laughs> This stuff is from Amazon and it only costs $15. For a pack of cones, a ladder for your agility ladder drills, and a parachute. Got the parachute on. I'm gonna start from that baseline all the way down there, sprint into the ladder, do the ladder drill while dribbling, move on to the cones, and finish with a layup. Good luck. <laughs> you can do it. Three, one. Slip wrap's fault. Two, one. Ah! Finish the layup! Yes! Let's go. The parachute, the cones, and the ladder. You could use them in a ton of different ways. I'll give them a thumbs up for $15. The next gadget we're gonna be testing out is the this is an in the lab silent basketball and clearly it makes no noise. And you're gonna need this basketball when your mom is yelling at you because you're trying to work on your handle in the house. Hey, stop dribbling that basketball. What dribbling mom? This ball costs $45. It's a foam ball, kind of like at a foam pit if you've ever been to a trampoline park, but it's in a circular shape, the size of a basketball that you would actually be playing basketball with. There's two different sizes. They have a men's and they have a women's. It doesn't completely come back like a regular basketball. However, it does do the eye coordination job. Sit there and work on getting a ball of this size in between your legs. So then you can work on being efficient. We're gonna try this basketball out in the course. We're gonna try it one time and whatever happens, happens. Honestly, the ball handling with that ball through the course was actually better than I was expecting. The layup absolutely blew it. I give the in the lab basketball a thumbs up. If you have a yelling mom, 
who doesn't want you to play basketball or work on your handle in the house or in the basement, in the lab, is the ball for you. All those gadgets I showed you were $50 and less. Now we move on to gadgets that are $60 and more. So instead of getting a $15 parachute that comes with a ladder and cones, you can get a resistance band. That's $60. You're strapped to this, someone else is strapped to this end or an object, example A. Now most people know you usually have a person or a partner who's holding you back, that's giving you resistance. A lot of us have done that in practice, but this is a little bit different. If I pull, it's pulling me back. There's a lot of resistance going on right now. And if I go back, I snap back. Oh my God. And now it's pulling me back. It's working on your core strength, your legs. You being able to control the ball as you're being pulled back helps you work on your power in your moves. Go. I'd give this gadget, I'm unsure about it. For $60, I'm not sure that you need it. You can work on your power in other ways. The next gadget is $70. These are the power hands. They're weighted gloves with this slick covering right here. So you don't have any grip on the basketball. Obviously you don't shoot with these strictly ball handling. They definitely make you lose grip. That's one thing for sure. I can't grip this ball at all. I don't know if that's good or bad. I feel like I'm carrying it. I'm giving it a thumbs down. I don't think it's necessary. I'd rather go with the $10 slick wrap or the little goggle things. Final and last gadget, you guys have seen it before, is the dribble up basketball. This ball is $100. That's more than a Wilson Evolution basketball. However, this basketball is one of a kind. There is an app that allows you to get coached by a trainer that is monthly. There are some free training videos on the app, but most of it you pay for monthly. Now, I absolutely love the quality of this basketball. It's not a cheapo. It's not Ooh. cheap at all. The leather is super, super duper quality. It's got great grip, super padded. Feels like an amazing basketball. Feels a little bit better than a Wilson Evolution ball. I do feel like the dribble up basketball does level up your handles with having to do unique, different dribbling drills that are different from your basic drills that you do with, let's say your team or alone. I'm gonna give this dribble up basketball a thumbs up. If you're looking for an advanced basketball handling tool, I wish I had one would have took my handles even greater when I was younger. If you can afford a $100 basketball and the training videos, maybe you can do every other month. Whatever you can do with your dominant hand, you need to be able to do with your opposite hand. Work is work at the end of the day, whether you go with a $5 shack basketball or you go with a $100 dribble up basketball with advanced training videos, whatever you choose, you have to put the work in to have the best handles you can possibly have. Make sure to check out the cheap versus expensive basketball video or the cheap versus expensive basketball sneaker video. Love you fam. Peace. Hello. You see me and I'm grinding.